Hey guys, it's Tracy. In today's video, I'm going to budget for paycheck number one for the month of June. I am using the Elevated Life Co. budget book. And let's go to the calendar spread. So paycheck number one, that was on the 9th, and that's going to cover bills from the 9th to the 22nd. Financial overview. <clears throat> I want to continue to meal plan. I have a uh, graduation to attend. Well, that already happened. And then there's also uh, a transfer achievement ceremony that already happened. I have a birthday and then we have Father's Day. And things that I just want to remember to do is <clears throat> I'm going to have a little graduation party for my daughter. So I need to order some graduation decor which I did already. We have to call the internet company regarding our discount program plan that we need to let them know to see if we qualify for that. Um, I need to print some pictures for the cake and to have for the graduation party. And then I need to order two cakes. The day of her graduation party my daughter's birthday is the day before, so I just want to have a birthday cake and a graduation cake, and I need to order cupcakes. Uh, for paycheck, the paycheck budget. So let's see. So for the paycheck budget, that was on June 9th. And in the income section, we have my husband's paycheck. He is paid bi-weekly. And his check was $1,680. It's a little less because they owe him five hours of, um, they didn't pay him five hours. So that's going to get adjusted for next paycheck. And then we have, um, my kids, they help out with 250. And then I started to get child support again. So child support, I only got $80. So hopefully that continues. Let's add that up. 1680, 250, and 80. The total is $2,010. Then we're going to go down here to fixed expenses. And the first thing we do is give. So we have our tithe. That budget amount is 170. Then we have an offering that's going to be $25. Our mortgage is zero, but I still like to list it here. Water bill, we're going to send $150. And then the Google storage is $2. SCE, that's the Edison, our electric bill. Right now it's still at zero. We're producing enough <clears throat> with the solar. I guess we're producing enough. We have a zero bill right now. And then the gas company, we're going to send 80. Lawn, lawn services is $60. And then we're going to cash flow. Uh, three, I think it's three hundred dollars let me add that up so we have father's day is fifty dollars we're going to the lemon festival we're going to just take about fifty dollars and then for things that i need for the party for the graduation party we're going to cash so 200 okay so yeah that's three hundred dollars all right let's add that up 170 25, 150, $2, 80, 60, and 300. 7, 87. Let's check our math again. 170, 25, 150, $2, 80, 60, and 300. 787. Okay, and let's deduct our income. We have $1,223 left over. 
and then we're going to come down to savings so mini emergency sinking fund we're going to send $25 property taxes and insurance we're going to send 350 and then our savings account that's just to cover annual bills we're going to send $100 so let's add that up we got 25 25 350 and 100 that's 475 and let's deduct the remaining amount that we had 1223 we have 7 48 all right so we have 748 for two weeks we keep track of groceries and household and also it includes our um, the food for our pets and then we have gas um, let's see eating out medical and miscellaneous okay so we have seven hundred and forty eight dollars left over for we have seven hundred and forty eight dollars left over for two weeks we don't keep we don't budget a specific amount for our variable expenses we just try not to go over what is left over for two weeks okay all right so that is our paycheck budget for paycheck number one for the month of june if you made it this far, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, give this video a like, and if you have a question or a comment, leave it below, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Take care. Bye.